Allow me to illuminate the situation. <laughs> Do you know the hardest part of being a trainer is? <laughs> Apart from voice training, of course. <laughs> Less said about that, the better. Shut up. The the hardest part of being a trainer is uh, socialization. When when we first tune out, up until that point, we've been male socialized and um, from birth all the way up to tuning out we have we, we've been brought up as males um, educated as males nurtured as males we we in, we um, inhibit in, in inhibit we 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 possess inhibit I didn't <laughs> we, we we have male social cues we, we adopt male social cues male male mannerisms and we can get into nature versus nurture on this one i think it's a little bit of both but we we, we have male psyche be it our subconscious behavior is inherently male now for some trainers especially those that um, Especially those that transition really young, you know, before puberty, it, it doesn't really affect them because the, the bulk of your socialization happens around school time. So they'll go to school as females and be socialized as, as females. But uh, for people like me who are <laughs> in tuning out after puberty, we've already got that uh, male socialization um, embedded in us the more uh, biologically programmed behaviors the, the, the more the, the evolution uh, evolutionary psychology that, uh, that 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 takes more of a hold yeah it's really hard first socializing as a trans girl because I have no um, no, no source, no, no baseline to um, adopt behaviors and mannerisms and social cues from. I mean, I lived with my girlfriend Katie, but apart from that, <laughs> and, and it's kind of it sounds kind of creepy saying it like this, but I, I, I have actually adopted a lot of my ex-girlfriends mannerisms and, and and the way they talk uh, particularly because they're the only examples I have of, 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 of how to be a girl you know as a male to female transsexual we have completely separate and different lived experiences to uh, females natal females completely different lived experiences what comes naturally naturally to them is just completely alien to us and this matters a lot this matters a lot more than you think um, I th I've seen trans people trying to dismiss this as oh it doesn't matter you know or, or trans women are real women but uh, your yeah, socialization matters a lot I mean as a male to female we've never We've never had to be afraid walking home at night like like women do. You, you see what I mean? The two completely different experiences right there that um, that, that modify and, and and nurture our behavioral patterns down a certain path. Right? We've never been sexually harassed. On a daily basis and, and then be gaslighted that it's just banter and we have to put up with you know as a smack on the bum wolf whistling we've we've never had to put up with this uh, we, we, women have all their life I mean young young girls they've they they grow up learning how perverted being preyed on by perverted old old men we've We've never had that. and if you this modifies and constructs your behavior um, social cues your mannerisms 
how you put yourself across in public, how you behave in public. I, I, don't, I don't know why a, a lot of trans women seem offended by this fact or, or seem to hate women for this. I mean, it's not the, it's not the women's fault that you weren't born a woman. No, you, were, you were born male. You, you were brought up male. You were socialised as male. It's fine. Okay, I wish I wish I was born a woman too. I wasn't. I, I, I was born a male and that's how people treated me until I tuned out. And it's fine. You, you, you can reverse it. Somewhat. I, to what extent, as I believe, probably depends on your age. Probably. Nothing to hate women for or call them TERFs just because they, they bring the subject up uh, about their lived experiences. We have to be responsible and reasonable when it comes to these things. Back to why I made this video. <laughs> I have no idea how to act like a girl. I suppose. It probably sounds sexist to the green hair brigade but you know f females natal females and natal males do have different behavioral patterns that's just facts and a transsexual who's transitioning from one to the other obviously p p passing is a big deal and, and passing isn't just about your appearance or your looks yeah. or your voice shut up about my voice I can, I can hear you there. I can, I can hear you. I, are you going to send me money for, for the voice coaching? No? Then shut up. I'll, I'll get a girl voice when I can afford it, alright? But it's also how to behave in a social setting as a girl. And uh, I'm, st I'm, I'm really struggling navigating friendships as a girl now. Um, my my interactions with guys uh, uh, has changed so much. I, I can't believe how extreme the differences are of uh, how a guy interacts with you as a guy and how a guy interacts with you as a girl. The 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 difference is I'm finding it hard to maintain pl 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 platonic pl platonic platonic pl platonic. Mutual, non-sexual friendships with with guy platonic. I'm sure it's platonic. Yeah, it's platonic. It is now anyway. <laughs> yes, I'm English and don't know English. Shut up. Yeah, I'm I'm struggling to maintain pl platonic, 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 platonic. I'm going to once. I'm going to Google this play, platonic. Platon, yeah, platonic. Ha, huh. sounds right. <laughs> yes. I'm struggling to maintain platonic, plutonic. Now, plutonic sounds more correct -er to me. Yeah. Non-sexual. I'll, I'll say that. I, I'm, I'm struggling to maintain plutonic, non-sexual relationships. Non, because with, with a guy. Apart from apart from my gay friends who I was friends with back before I tuned out, apart from those, but uh, any new guy, it always devolves into flirting or yeah, which which is nice because they're treating me like a girl, I guess. But um, <laughs> yeah, friendship friendships with. I'm, I'm struggling um, of how to navigate that. Um, you see, I don't go out much. I, I don't go out much. So beyond video games, I don't have much interaction with humans. I mean, a little on Twitter now and again, maybe. See, I don't have any interactions with um, any any girls, any natal natural girls. All my new friends date tend to be other trainers or femboys who I, uh, are pretty much in the same boat as me on the socialization front. I'm going to have to make friends with some uh, women and hang out with them a lot more to pick up their social cues and mannerisms. But it feels, it feels so weird. You, you, 
you're there taking mental note, you feel like some kind of it's kind of kind of weird, isn't it? I suppose that's part of the reason why this is the hardest part of uh, being a trainer. I found. Yeah, sorry for the weird random video. Yeah, I couldn't sleep and just had this on my mind. <laughs> how, do, how, 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 how? I mean, I'm on HRT. I mean, once I look like a girl, then what? How, how do I actually? Go out and act like why well, yeah, I just because they even walk different to 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 males and and thus male to female transsexuals they walk even walk different and they hold their hands different and and, and they flirt different ah, this is so hard Maybe becoming becoming a tranny doesn't come with a manual but it should please please write a manual. Maybe I should get Gammy to write we write a manual. She, I'm a bit of a Gammy simp, and she's she's. By the way, <laughs> I'm sorry, if, sorry if that upsets anyone. But have you seen her tweets? She's she's she, she says what most of us think and are too scared to say. And I think I should stop being such a coward and start speaking up more, instead of just uh, quietly liking her post. <laughs> anyway. Mm. Big Sis is going to try and get some sleep. Thanks for listening to my rambling, anyone that did. I'm, I'll try to make the next video a bit uh, more cohesive and on point. <laughs> Maybe talk about my model and lore and future goals and stuff. Okay. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See ya, suckers. Zippity.